what is happening what is going on welcome back to the channel if you're new here thanks for stopping by and if you are a old viewer thanks for continuing to support the channel so in this tutorial i'm going to show you how to create this scene it's really easy really simple let's get into blender okay so first thing i want to do is i'm going to go here to the world make this dark then what i want to do is go shift a Add a plane, scale it up, and then right click, and then click tab, right click, subdivide, and just divide about 20 times. Okay, now go here, add a modifier, add a Displace, click new, go here, go to clouds, and then bring the scale up, or the size up, sorry. Something like that, the depth. To about one now scale it up go here g and bring it forward something like that go to top view g and just now rotate it Something like that. Okay. And then what you can do is just flatten it out a bit. Perfect. Now I click on it, right click, shade it smooth. Okay, go shift A. Add a plane. And then scale it up. Something like that, and then bring it up and go to top view. Okay, and go G, bring it up like that, and then rotate it. Yes, seven arc. Like that, we can fix it later. Now, click on this plane. Go here to modify and add a solidify. Go out. Okay, looks good. Now, let's go shift A again. Go here to UV sphere, scale it up, go to top view, then go to side view, G, bring it up, then let's go to top view, and let's scale it up. Something like that. Okay, now go here to modifier and add a subdivision surface modifier. Perfect. Then shade smooth. Click on the plane, this one. Add another modifier, add a Boolean. Click here, add a sphere. Add apply, and then remove the sphere, which makes a nice hole. Now, bring this back, click on it, something like that. Okay, 
Perfect. Make sure you hide that there as well. Now, let's lock the camera in like this. Perfect. Okay, now, what do you want to do? Just bring this back. No, yeah. Gee, something like that. Okay. Now, put your camera to here and bring this to about 26. Let's change this to by 1080. Perfect. Now, what you want to do is bring in another UV sphere here. But before that, get a light. So shift A, light, get a area light. G, bring it up, change this to a, yeah, here it is fine. And now, click on it, scale it up, so, make it mess up, go to the top view, perfect. And then, bring this up to about, we might have to bring it up more, let's have a look. Okay. Let's go to 5,000. For now. Now, next thing, let's go shift A again. Add another UV sphere, scale this up. Gee, let's bring it into like here. And make it a bit bigger. Make it a little bit smaller. All right, same thing. Just enable this. Add a modifier. Add a subdivision surface modifier. And then shade smooth. Okay. Next thing, let's go cube. Let's just make sure that this fits in it. Perfect. Okay, cube, shift A. And then this one's gonna have to be massive. Go to shading, go to new, delete this, principal BSDF. Shift A and add a volume. And then plug the volume into the volume. Bring this 0 0.1. Let's have a look. Now let's bring in the light. There we go. Now we're getting somewhere. So let's go. 0 0.5, that's what I meant to do. Add in the shadow caustics, not the portal. Okay, now what you can do is go to the area light, change the color. Something like that. You can play with. If you want a disc, if you want the ellipse, or if you want a square. I like the disc. That's nice. Kind of volume. Okay, and then what you want to do is let's go here. Asset browser. Just going to bring in a model. A 
rotate him. So give it some scale. And then have a look. Hard this. And then just bring him down. Just have a look. G. Perfect. And there we go. What you can do is you can always texture these. So if you want, I've got a nice texture pack from Mr. Ducky. So what you could do is click on the ball, add a maybe something like a metal. So maybe something like that and have a look hide this yeah and in this you can obviously texture with like maybe something like this or like that let's try that you can see that add something you can always go that Change the color obviously, just something simple, all that looks pretty good, but yeah, that's a very quick scene, you can always go to Polyhaven, Asset Browser, or just from the website, and get textures, like if I um, can always just go down here to ground to find like a and then I just drag and drop it on yeah so hopefully you enjoyed the video if you did smash the like button and I'll see you in the next one